is up everybody this is easy easy street gaming but you know the brutal age video and let's rewind so we can check out what zerk's checking out he got busted pretty bad shouldn't do any late night editing looks like <laughs> this video's on the the dragon shaman just got it from the last event uh, all three colors were available the first one was the easiest to get it was green uh, i'm going to go over all three uh, all, all three colors kind of do a comparison on the three. I'm not sure if um, I Know what people thought I'm I, I'm thinking that things were a little different than what people thought. I'm not sure uh, I'm, I'm gonna briefly go over all the skills first one was called Thundershock. It's his normal attack it attacks one 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 Opponent hit them with a lightning bolt Mine was doing over a thousand damage at level 10. So it's gonna be a pretty powerful attack uh, second skill for green is thunder control and it is a um, I think it's a healing type ability the higher hit, the higher attack he gets the, the better his hit point increases are it also increases everyone's buff for another round and then the last skill is called thunder stimulation for life and now this is a heal this is a healing type thing um, they, uh, he gives the whole team 30% hit points but there's a there's a percentage of a chance that he can inflict blind on his own teammates so it's an it's a different type of, a, of an ability a different type of skill than we've ever seen before he can actually hurt his own teammates and here you see at four star how much the blue gives and I'm kind of doing them in order that I think was the strongest and I don't really know for a fact yet but this is not the order that we, we would have got him um, blue is actually the hardest to get by far and I'll explain why in a minute his first skill was the same as green. The second skill is called Mega Thunder Shock. It is basically the same as the Mega Shock, except for it does it to two different opponents. So it doesn't attack all three, but it does two opponents. There's also a, let me think. There's also a chance that he can inflict blind as well on the on, on the opponents. And then uh, he has the Lightning Stimulation Action, which is a little bit different than greens, but it has the same uh, potential negative effects. The only difference is I think um, he can reduce your own team's defense for two rounds instead of uh, instead of inflicting blind on him. So a little bit different results for the penalty for using it. Then you have the red dragon shaman, and again I'm thinking red is the best, even though red wasn't the most expensive. I think most people were, were a little confused. If you if you look at how much value the game the brutal age puts on their ancient uh, turtles. That kind of gives it, uh, gives it away. They put the ancient turtle with blue. They had a very high price tag on it, but I think a lot of that price tag was because of the ancient turtle. Uh, he has the same first attack. Second attack or for second skill is called the mega mega thunder shock. Does it look familiar because it's the same as as blues. And for his third skill, it's called the overload. Is it the biggest attack of the three? It just might be. This is another one that has the marks. We've seen marks in uh, the the pumpkin and the, the Rudolph. This one you can collect four marks and it can add up to 60% more damage if all four marks have been collected and he unloads on them. All three of them have different uh, strengths and skills. Green has a high attack. Um, he's got the lowest speed of the three of them. But um, none of them are really low. Uh, but as far as the attack and the defense, none of them are really high either. They're all right there in the 300s basically. But I think that can be improved a lot on in the actual basic skills. Uh, blue has the highest speed at 109. So for basic speed at 109 at 6 stars, this is all 6 star stats right here. Uh, that's pretty pretty high. Uh, just for basic. Uh, lowest hit points of them all. But um, really not that low. And then red has the highest hit points. And I believe the lowest defense. under Dips under 300 for defense. But... Really, I mean, right at 300, I mean, if, just remember, like, B Blue Nomad's, his attack is 350 um, on the stat sheet. And you, we know how high that can get with the once you actually get up there. I built a kind of odd team to put with the Green Shaman. I have the Fencer, I have the, the new uh, Tusk, and I have the Bally, everyone's favorite. Figured you, everyone gets to see a couple of the new heroes and, and one that very rarely gets any, any, uh, any gameplay. Never mind ga gameplay on YouTube. <laughs> I've also had to speed this up to times two because I was playing in in, uh, in times three, but my computer was going slow. Or maybe I was playing in times one to, so I could see better, but it was it was dragging on, so I just had to uh, go back and do some editing. 
Nothing better than editing while you're while you're recording. So it looks like uh, Tusk is doing a less damage than the Bally. You can see that's the that's the buff for the whole team by the by the Dragon Shaman. Yeah, the Red Fencer, Swift, Power Attacker, real good against one enemy. It also has the Retaliate. So whenever you see them attack her and there's zero damage, you know that she's got an attack coming back at them. And there's one of Tusk. The blue's not the strongest. I believe Green Tusk is the strongest. He does. Um, he has some kind of immune for the whole team. Uh, blue does. Does you do benefit with Blue too though? I think he he does a plus thirty resistance for the whole team. But don't try to stack that up because it's not stackable. Uh, but speaking of um, odd statistics, we have something else. Um, another statistic that we're, I'm looking into. I don't have any definite answers yet. You know, I don't have a, a phone line directly to uh, Brutal Age, so I don't know how to get some of these answers right away. But one of the abilities that the Dragon Shaman has is the ability that, or the skill where he will inflict damage on the other team, but there's also a chance that he can inflict damage or inflict a uh, debuff on his own team. Um, one of them, I believe it's blue that does the debuff of uh, blind, and red does the debuff of... Uh, De minus defense and my question is do they get an advantage from having more hit and will that actually hurt your own team if you add hit to either blue or red I'm saying don't add hit to them at all right now until we can figure out whether or not if you add uh, Corsac to your dragon shaman will that actually affect your own team and can he uh, actually inflict debuffs on his own team at a high rate because of hit something that uh, I want to look into that and we'll have an answer for that hopefully in 2019 <laughs> the last of the team is the blue valor oh, oh the blue valor the tusk he has team resistance plus he does group attacks I think he's gonna be pretty stout I've already seen many of them maxed out got great great graphics like all the new all the newer heroes have uh, have really good graphics on them. Um, Blue's definitely not the strongest. I'm gonna I'm gonna say, but I haven't got him maxed out to level uh, at six star yet. I got him at uh, I believe it's, uh, this one here is at 35, but he's got a long way to go with his war pattern. He's got a long way to go. Period. And so we went on. To the, I went on to the chat. I asked if anyone had any replays. And Zanny, who I I'm, I actually have a whole video with all of her stuff coming out in it. Cause she's been a, a, a huge help. She put, posted this up. This has got all three colors with the green tusk. And I believe green tusk might be the strongest. He's got a really good uh, bu buff for the whole team. Or immune or something. We'll find out here. And there's uh, there's no doubt that the new partners are going to be strong. Um, I'm thinking that they may be the strongest four star. I know that that's, that's a lot to say in week one. But just from what I've seen, if they don't change anything, I don't see many of the others being able to compete I mean even even the blue black shaman um, with his group attacks is gonna have is gonna be he'll be hard-pressed to compete with the damage that I'm seeing from them already and I mean look my, mine is uh oh that, that, that's hers never mind it's like wow mine's already doing 2,000 damage but it's not mine <laughs> and I'm, I'm not sure for war, war patterns I, I haven't really even thought about advising on war patterns because it's so new but I do know this, that they have several skills that benefit from, from speed. And they have, I know that there's one on green that the heal, healing benefits from, from hit points or health points. I want to get that right one of these days. Or attack. That's what it is. <laughs> Jesus. The higher attack, the more health points it gets back. So that you, you're going to want to increase their speed to the max. So most likely you're going to have cat war pattern. If you're pretty crafty and you can uh, use use Smilodon or use the Lion and get really good war patterns and, and, and get speed on every single one of the war patterns, you might be able to get away with not using actual cat as a war pattern and using an attack war pattern. And then you can get both the attack and the speed up really high. I believe that these guys, you want their attack and speed up as high as possible. And um, I'm going to put out the actual partner video in order. Once I get to that point, I'm still in the three stars. My next video coming out is the red blonde as far as the partner guides. So, um, and them being the number one four star, I think right now they're the number one four star. So we got a little ways to go before we get to them. But you can see them, they're doing a number on Saya. I'm not showing the actual damage above it for whatever reason. I have no idea. 
and if you notice the black bar across the bottom we are now producing every video in I think 10 languages as far as the subtitles go we're trying to get some of our um, Chinese and in, in, um, in Arabic brothers to, to watch the channel and they can't just watch my listen to my voice because that's that sucks just give them something to read so the dragon dragon shaman awesome partner you want the dragon shaman look at their skills not their cost I think their cost was very deceptive um, I think that the cost of them will kind of manipulate people into getting the blue instead of red, which I think red was the hot, was the hottest one. Um, for now, watch hit. I would not suggest putting hit on on anyone that can do damage to their own partners because that might actually hurt you more. And if you already have the desired color, keep on making them. I don't know if we're going to get this event again, but I think I think we might. I, you know, I, I just don't know. But hope you enjoyed it. Got Berserker and Blonde coming up next kind of shorter video. I know they're long when I have all three partners on all three colors. So until next time, it's been easy. Take care, everybody.